In this particular bonus video, I'm going to show you how to turn a mini site template into a web page. Now, I'm not going to show you exactly how to create a mini site, but if you create a mini site, let's say for example in Adobe Photoshop, and you import that into Adobe Image Ready, then you can use the same methods of slicing that I showed you with the video squeeze page templates. So here we go. In this particular video, I decided to use the form niche gold mines because if I go to my graphics and I go to the PSD section, what happens normally is when I hire a graphic designer and they produce a mini site, they usually send me a template that has the header and the footer all together and combined. Now, a lot of you might be in the same boat, but a lot of you might want to create your own mini site in Adobe Photoshop or in Adobe Image Ready first and then slice it. But how do you do that so everything is in one page? Now, if I open up template.psd in Image Ready, it looks like this. And let's say that I'm customizing this. I change the title to something else and I change the images and all that. And then I make all the changes. Let's say that all the changes have been made. To slice it, what I need to do is click on the slice tool. And what I need to do is separate this image from this image. And then I need to make an area down here so that I can add my sales copy. To do that, all I have to do is click here, click somewhere out here in the gray area above the header, left click and there we go. Now that I have done this, I need to click on the bottom area so I can select the footer like so. And then we've separated these two. And then of course using the slice window we can click the slice select tool, click on the header, and then change the name and call this the header. And the alt tag would be form niche gold mines video series. And I could do something similar to the footer and just say footer. and click file and click on save optimize as html and in this case we're going to name it form niche gold mines new click on save and if i go to my desktop you can actually see that here and if i open up the images folder you'll notice that there's the footer the header and the side. Okay, so now we're going to right click and open with NVU. And there we go. So we got the header, then we got the footer, and then we got an area here that we want to add the sales letter to. Now, if we click on the middle area here and we click on enter, and we put enough space between this one and this one you'll notice that it looks exactly what we saw earlier now what I need to do now is that when image ready exports it into HTML format it left aligns everything so what we need to do is center align everything so I need to click here right click click on table cell properties click on table and click on center align and apply and make sure the background is white click apply and click OK and then I want to make sure that the actual background of the whole page is dark blue so I click on format page colors and background click on background and we're going to turn it to navy blue click on OK click save and then for SEO optimization purposes you can click on page title 
and properties. You can add the title, the author as you, and a description of that specific product. Press OK, click on Save, and we're going to close this down. And then we're going to run this in Firefox. And there we go. So you basically have turned your mini site and you, you can tweak it, you can do anything you want, and then you can add the sales letter here. So as you can see here, the same concepts that you learn with the video squeeze templates with slicing and optimization is basically the same thing when in relation to mini site designs. So good luck with that and I hope this video series has been very educational for you and you can go out there and customize your sites a lot more than what you can do now.